Hello everyone, my name is Tin. I'm here to help you with your logins. Um, so the first thing you need to do is to go onto the BMCC website and the address is right up here, bmcc.cuny.edu. Um, all the important logins are right over here. Under logins, you click on this and all of these are the, um, the different accounts logins that you have to have as a BMCC CUNY student. So the first thing you need to do in order to claim your student account or student email is actually not student email, it's a BMCC portal. Okay, so just a reminder, BMCC portal is for you guys. It's the account that you use to log into any of the computers here at the school. Um, if you're using any computer at the library, computer labs, in the lounge, you use your BMCC portal account, okay? Um, it's the same username and password that you will use for your student email account. So that's why we're talking about the, both of them um, in the same video, okay? So um, go ahead and click on BMCC portal, and you get to this page. And what I want you guys to do is to click on account and password help. So you'll get to this part. Um, put in all the information. Okay, um, put in first name, last name, last four, your social, um, your EMPL ID number, uh, birth month, and birth year, okay? Click on not a robot and submit that, all right? Um, and then you're going to get to the next page. So this is the next page that you'll get. It's, um, you have to create a username, I'm sorry, a uh, password. So the password has to meet all of these criteria. It's a lot. So um, just a general rule of thumb, what I like to do is just to put CUNY start and four numbers. Use like a pen. Um, but when you spell out CUNY or what, when you spell out something, make sure that you're using um, mixed case. So first um, letter has to be capital or however you want to do it, but make sure that it's mixed case. Okay, so... Um, for me, um, so when it's all green like this, that means that it hit all the uh, criteria to, to be a password, okay? So make sure you don't spend too much time on this. I've seen students spend way too much time on this. Don't overthink it. Just make sure that it's um, something easy to remember. Okay, and make sure you write it down too. All right, so I created my username, or I'm sorry, I keep on saying that, uh, my password. Um, and then go ahead and click Submit. Ooh, what happened? It doesn't match. All right, so I'm gonna try something else. Um, hmm. Okay. All right, that should match. Let's try it again. What? All right. This is embarrassing. Hold on. Um, let me see. It has to be eight letters or eight eight characters. Um, all right, hold on. Um, what? Oh my god, I give up. Now, um, let me try it again. This keyboard is also very sticky, so I don't know why. That might be it. Um, okay, so this is this is gonna work. I promise you. Okay. All right. So um, we got to that point. Um, so this is my username, T Tran. Um, and this is the username that you're going to use from now on, again, to um, 
to log into your computer, but this is also your email address. So your email address should be first initial um, and your last name. Okay, and it's going to be at stu.bmcc.cuny.edu. Okay, um, so we're going to start a new page. And we're going to go on to, to the BMCC website again. And we are going to student email. Okay. And you're going to sign. Okay. So um, whatever it is, it's going to be like this. S-T-U dot B-M. Oops. See. S-T-U dot B bmcc dot cuny dot edu okay so when you click on this I'm not going to click on it because this is not my email address I have a faculty email address that looks different than this um, this is stu stands for student so this is what you're going by so whatever your um, your username it's at stu at bmcc dot cuny dot edu all right, and then you click next, and then you put in the same password that you're using for um, the BMCC portal, the one that I really struggled with to come up with. Um, that's your user, that's your username and password. And then you click on this, and you should be good to go um, in claiming your um, your email. Okay, so that is it. Um, again, if you have any questions, make sure you check in with your advisor. Um, it's a little tricky, but, you know, it takes a little time to kind of get used to. Um, but, you know, if you have any issues, uh, you know, check in with your advisor, okay? Um, hope that was helpful, and um, that is all I got for today, okay? All right, take care. Bye.